After being wrongfully convicted of a murder they did not commit, two Buffalo men are demanding the city and county pay up. The two surviving members of what's known as the Buffalo Five filed a lawsuit today seeking more than $200 million. News for Sarah Minkowitz joins us now with the details. Thinking back over the whole struggle we had as far as this fight, thinking back as far as when I was 16 years old, me and my friends, and how our life was stolen from us. John Walker and Daryl Boyd were both wrongfully convicted of the 1976 murder of William Crawford. That conviction has since been overturned, but only after the two men spent decades in prison. And then after that, put through suffering, pain, and misery, and then only be returned back to the location where I was kidnapped from to be up under the supervision of parole. Now, Boyd and Walker are each suing the city, the county, and several former detectives for $112 million. They are suing for the years they spent in prison, plus punitive damages. Inspired by John and Daryl. Despite having their lives stolen from them at a very young age, they never stopped pushing for the very system that wronged them to recognize their innocence. We are in awe of their courage in their decades-long struggle to have their convictions overturned and their names cleared. In their lawsuit, they accuse former Buffalo Police homicide detectives of withholding evidence and using lies and pressure tactics to pin a murder on five innocent teenagers. And if, if they recognize when they review the facts of this case and the evidence uh, that John and Darrell are almost certainly innocent, mm -hmm. uh, and if they recognize that their rights were violated and they spent their lives were ruined for no reason, then they should do the right thing. And no matter what they decide to give me, can't give me back what was taken from me.